let the gems find you. I mean, these were calling my name. They're not my size, unfortunately. Hello, welcome back to A Vintage Splendor. I'm Annette, and today we are at one of my favorite places, Crossroads. I am back at the Echo Park location, which is one of their newest stores that they open. And a few months ago, I came here and I had one of the best shopping days ever. So I wanted to come back today and show you how I find the best stuff at Crossroads. It is always such a fun shopping adventure for me. So I'm going to take you behind my tips and tricks and behind the scenes of shopping at Crossroads. All of the crossroads are laid out and organized to enhance the shopping experience. So what I do is I always start with their trend racks, their staff picks. I feel like all of the stores have some of the most stylish staff members and then they pull pieces as they come in and then they put them in racks. So you'll see racks that say new arrivals, trend. And then I'm gonna show you where the staff picks are. So look for staff picks because this is where you're going to find those really cool, unique, interesting pieces that have flair. So this is my first stop. And then I always look behind the counter because you know, I'm a bougie gal and I love my designer pieces. So a lot of their handbags and their shoes are behind the counter. So I love to see what they have there. And I'm already spotting some red Marc Jacobs heels, which I'm gonna have to try on. I look is what's hanging up on the walls like this is again another way to spot the best and most interesting stuff like quickly again Isabel Morant one of the brands I always look for when I shop here I already spotted a skirt which I'm gonna have to try on so my order of preference staff picks behind the counter what's hanging on the wall to find the best stuff at Crossroads, step out of your comfort zone. My golden rule is I don't come to Crossroads looking for specific things. I let the pieces find me and I will tell you, I know it's the opposite of manifestation, but it's really opening up your mind and your wardrobe to really good pieces. And perfect example, this 70s inspired suede skirt just found me. It's calling me. This fabulous like cropped like velvet and sheer mesh little crop top situation it found me just calling to me okay at crossroads go section by section um, and start with the sections that you know that you usually like to find stuff. I always look in tops or denim and then I move on to skirts. And a special note is they always have really good vintage pieces, but they're mixed in to all of just the racks. So you don't want to skip any sections because you don't want to miss the gems. I really like this. This is why I think it's open to keep an open mind because then you can find pieces. I feel like I always find really good mesh layering pieces here. And I know we're still in summer, but as we enter fall, I love finding really thin turtlenecks because they're great for layering. I mean, just think about the outfit I'm wearing right now. If I just wanted to add a pop of color, this would look really great. This would be good to put under something a little bit more tailored and crisp, but just like a black bra and some jeans this is a really good piece okay there's like a few contemporary brands i always look for when i come here isabel morant Ula johnson stodd but what i love finding at crossroads are those like offbeat small unique indie labels that you can't find anywhere else because you don't know how what to search them if you're looking online at the thrift store probably won't find them but at crossroads i always find those like really cool indie brands and they always have really good pieces like look at these pants the brand is de Miraculo, and i don't know if these are part of like costume set but like these are so cool i love these pants i really hope they fit but look for those interesting 
brands and those tags at crossroads and like again keep that open mind because you can find gems like this <laughs> Versace always finds me. I usually don't look at the men's jackets and I spotted this Letterman style jacket. I love the colors. I love that it's an oversized fit. And this is a reminder to shop the whole store. Even if it's not a section you would typically shop in. I'm excited to try this on. I think you could wear this over jeans and a t-shirt and do like layered pearl necklaces, gold chains, go like extra feminine with the jewelry, but like very, very like, I borrowed my boyfriend's Letterman jacket or you know, my brother's, my dad's, whatever. <laughs> yeah, this is cool. This could be like a good one. Let's camp vlog not <laughs> It's a music festival. <laughs> I don't even know what this is. Let me explain this to me, Chloe. This is why I love Crossroads. Look at how interesting this is. This does not have a brand tag. So it could have been homemade or like handmade. And it's this really fuzzy yarn. And it's like hand crocheted with these buttons. Love the idea of throwing this on over just like a bralette and some like jeans, like wide leg denim, or even layering it on over a slip dress. But this is the kind of stuff that I love finding at Crossroads is like that offbeat, that unique pieces that you're not going to find anywhere else. And this is so soft. It's making me almost ready and excited for fall, but I'm still like summer vibes. So this is a really cute baby doll style dress. I love this. This is going to be 90s Betsy Johnson, thinking pattern tights, my platform Mary Jane's cute bow in my hair. It's like very much a vibe, but adding this to the pile okay so as you can see i'm going through the racks pretty quickly and i've obviously trained my eye over the years to look for particular prints patterns but then also the fabrics like i can spot you know things that are wool or silk or cotton or linen and that's what i'm generally looking for even though i'm like open to the different styles like i'm want like the really cool lacy pieces I saw the lace sleeves on this and that's what like stopped me so if you need to go through racks quickly you want to look for it like some of those key identifiers is like look for natural materials or look for the cool interesting colors and prints that you would typically wear let the gems find you I mean these were calling my name they're not my size unfortunately but they're Charlotte Olympia wedges look at the gold bow the red suede wedge these are so good and they've never been worn i'm so bummed because they're half off and if only they were my size i would so buy them i love charlotte olympia her heels are all so great and fun and they're like really really funky like i have a couple of her shoes the ones that you guys always ask me about because they're like neon and have all these colors and prints charlotte olympia the prints always call me and is a have mentioned in other videos i have certain outfit formulas that involve like a skirt and a sweatshirt so i'm always looking for skirts that i could style together with a sweatshirt i love the print of this it's giving very much gucci vibes just don't love a pleat on me too much and then i love this one this one's so fabulous I think this would be really great with an off the shoulder sweatshirt. This one is Ralph Lauren and I love this. I, I'm, even though I'm a maximalist, I'm very much all about that 90s Ralph Lauren vibes. And I love the silhouette of this skirt. It's a nice silk material and it, it has this great uh, scarf print on it. And I think this could be styled with heels with boots so i'm going to add this to my rack and i'm going to try it on and as you can imagine my rack is getting filled up very very quickly i think it's a requirement that i find a really great slip dress every time i come to a crossroads i love this color and this would be a really good layering piece actually to wear you know a tissue thin or mesh or second skin turtleneck under it and then maybe do a blazer some boots and really really have fun with all of the textures and different layers as opposed to just wearing it on its own and i love this color this color just looks really great and i think it would look really fabulous with like a navy or a lavender adding to the rack 
remember what I told you about vintage being mixed in with everything. You don't want to skip anything because I just found two really great vintage pieces. This is a vintage Hawaiian silk dress. Look at how fabulous this is. I love it. I love the silhouette. I love the shape. I love the color. I'm gonna look at this. Laura Ashley. I love it. I love Laura Ashley dresses so much. They are a must for any vintage lover. Just love the floral print. I love the cotton. I just like the detailing. So will these get added to my rack? Probably. <laughs> Before you leave the store, always look at the handbags, the belts, and the jewelry because I find really, really good like finishing touches, third pieces for my closet, and it's like really, really easy to just like scan and then find really colorful, unique pieces to add that like final touch. Hands are full, but had to look at um, the belt before I hop into the fitting room. I love this metal belt would be great for layering with other belts. And then I love this statement belt because those are always a must have for me. I don't have enough. So just always adding to it. Let's do an old fashioned fitting room try on session, which is my favorite thing to do because then I get to pull together everything. I've got accessories, I've got tops, I've got skirts, I've got bottoms i got dresses i have layering pieces so i'm just gonna have a really fun like fitting room montage let's start like, good denim suede mashup is first i love a denim and suede mashup but this top versace just speaks to my soul and this silhouette is just so great the cut it's new with tags I mean, I think this is immediately going into my yes rack because I could wear this with so many pieces. I love denim. I think even a denim or denim look would be really great. The skirt is also really great. I think suede skirts with like the button down in the front are closet staple. I have a couple of them. Um, I love this color. It's just a little big around the waist. So that's probably why I'm gonna not get it. But this is a reminder to try everything on regardless of the size, because sometimes items will be marked to size large, but they fit more like a small. Remember those cow print pants I bought here a couple of months ago? Those are a perfect fit. And then other times pieces are, you know, your size, but then they fit a little bit larger. So just try everything on. Give yourself a little bit of grace and just like have fun. I had the most fun in the fitting room trying on the different outfit combinations of like already having and working out in my head as I'm shopping. And then of course I add on the belt and this is literally probably like circa 1998 or 2002, Christina Aguilera, Misha Barton, Hilary Duff on the red carpet. Um, yes, you know, you're getting old when like the trends come full circle and this is where we're at again. But I love trying on different pieces. Like this belt is so great. I have a couple of belts like this, but I think this would be, be great like layered with another belt. So I was just thinking, obviously not with this particular belt, I've had a couple of metal belts, you know, just layer them. I love layering my statement belts, but it just adds a different vibe. So just like play around with pieces and twist this in the back because that's what's going to help you decide like what's going to work, what you need in your closet. And then that's how I like narrow down to like the best finds uh, in one shopping trip. When I grabbed this slip dress, I knew I wanted to layer it with like a mesh or a second skin turtleneck under it instead of just wearing it as is. So I kept this on, which I love. I think it's like really, really flattering. Um, but the idea I have with this is to, you know, do a lot of chunky necklaces, do a, you know, like menswear inspired blazer or jacket and then some boots for fall. So stay with me, um, even though these colors are not vibing together, but you kind of get an idea uh, what I have in mind. This Waterman style jacket is a little too big for me, but now I know I need one and maybe one size smaller, but imagine this look with a ton of jewelry, like chunky, silver chains with the right coloring and then 
with some boots or with some sneakers and maybe even a baseball hat. It's like such a fun look. So think of how to sell pieces in a lot of different ways. And when you're in the fitting room, actually pull the look together with what you have. And that's gonna help you like really like envision that like ideal outfit that you want. And then that's how you walk away with the best stuff. Okay, do we love this outfit? Or what? I mean, I just pulled them together and they just look so good, even with the shoes. Can we talk about these pants? They kind of remind me of the pants that Joey wears on Friends of that Thanksgiving episode where he's like the comfy pants that like you can eat multiple meals. I feel like this is what those pants feel like, but they don't look like that at all. They're so flattering. I love them. I love the floral print and then this little like handmade vest dress situation is so cool. So I wasn't sure exactly how to sell it. It's actually a vest. At first I thought it was a dress and it's such a great little styling piece to have. I'm thinking you could wear it with like another top with some flared jeans. I could wear it with um, my slip dresses and have it like just open it up a little bit. I don't know. I think these are both really fun styling pieces. This was a brand that is like very new to me. I didn't even recognize it. So again, like keep an eye out for the handmade pieces, the unique brands, indie brands that you would not find anywhere else. Laura Ashley. I love Laura Ashley. Like the fit, the silhouette of her dresses are stunning. If you don't have any, you need to add them to your like manifestation list as quickly as possible. They're like the perfect dresses to wear in the summer and into the fall. So anytime I see one, I try it on, if it's my size, if it fits, I buy it. Look at how beautiful this is. I just like love everything about it. It's cotton and then the best part, it has pockets right here. So you know, I could just be strolling down the street in my Laura Ashley. I always stop for the sunglasses. All of my sunglasses come from here. Always so great. Most of them are brand new, never worn. Love these. And then look at these. Love that. I can experiment with different trends and styles here and see what I like. best gems at crossroads and if you follow my tips you will find them too just remember trust the process let the items and gems find you i am shopping at the echo park location today but check the link below to find a crossroads near you and trust me there is a whole wardrobe waiting for you i will see you next friday at 8 a.m and be sure to catch me every friday right here on youtube bye